Hey guys, this is Scott of ET Database, and this is Dwarf Planet Series. And you see a structure inside of here. I believe these structures were mechanically grown, uh, biomechanically grown, uh, part living, part mechanical, because aliens like things to be, to be done fast, easy. They like to say it and have it done. Um, they're very lazy, unlike us, which are just a little bit lazy. Um, Aliens like things to be pre-made for them, and so they just, uh, you know, order them to be made, and they go get constructed. Uh, this, wow, there seems to be some kind of sculpture or something inside of there, but I really like this structure here. It's kind of cool, and you see some uh, tunnels underneath going this direction, and if we move a little bit over... And I will put the URL to this in the About section below the video. There looks like there is a ship, a triangle ship, parked here on this white structure. I believe this is a structure and is docked. Now, do you see that this is not pixelization? These right, right angles along here, those are actually uh, the edges of the ship that's parked there. A triangle, huge ship that's parked there, which is kind of cool. You also see a little bit of that over here. These are structures. You see these right angles. It's a sign that they are structures. And you see it right here all along. So this object right here, this long object, those are structures. Now you'll see more right here. Uh, can you see right along here and over here? It's a little blurry in this section, a little bit harder. Uh, but there are some areas that show that that show uh, interesting structures. Now, inside these craters, you also see structures. And it's kind of amazing. Look at that. There's a structure on top of another structure in this one. Over here, the structure is so old in here that it appears to be buried by uh, dust and, and whatever's on the lunar surface of this moon. Uh, over here, you see another one. Can't make it too large. We'll lose the focus on it. Uh, but it's just absolutely amazing. You can't really go anywhere on Dwarf Planet series without finding a crap load of structures. And here we are again. Here is a structure in the shape of a face. Eye, eye, nose. Uh, looks like a mouth. Uh, doesn't look like art to me, but to them, I guess it is. There are a lot of structures right over here. Look at all these. Can you see all these structures, guys? There are a lot. There's probably more structures than there are surface of Ceres in this area. And we're kind of in the uh, southern polar region of Ceres. Now, over here, you see a ship that's landed and a smaller ship that's docked above it. Do you see that? Wow, that is amazing. Guys, down in the lower right corner down here, it says 50 km. I don't know if you can see that in the video. It says 50 km from here to here. So this object is about 75 km from nose to back. That is incredible. The size of this ship is un freaking believable and yet it's right there in front of us with Google Ruler right down here on a Google website. Uh, this is just crazy, crazy cool. Uh, so let's look over here. Uh, they have some structures over here. Sometimes you need to stop and just look at the structure for a little while. It really helps your eyes to focus because um, there's so much there. Sometimes your eyes can't see it. And it takes a few seconds, even a few minutes for me to focus on it. Uh, so can you see the, the white structure inside here? I believe all of this is fake, that the, the crater here is fake, and it's actually all of this around the edges and everything is structure in itself. There's a small ship hovering over this area. There is a black structure over here. Don't know if you can see that. This is all black structure. Um, kind of awesome, guys. Really, really is. You see so many structures inside of here. Um, it does take time, so I want you to click on the URL below my link and explore for yourself some of the things here and find some things that I don't report, which is pretty easy. 
is really easy. I mean, there's just too many things here. Okay, guys. So uh, go and check out this amazing photo. And let's go back to the ship. That is just incredible, isn't it? Okay. This is Scott, T Scott C. Waring, ET Database, signing out. Like and subscribe.